Brain-Based Education by MLWeb Group 8. By the end of this course, the participants should be able to define the meaning of brain-based learning, understand how the brain acts in the learning process, identify different learning styles, recognize different theories of the brain-based education, illustrate different applications of brain-based learning theories, state the concepts and benefits of brain-based assessment, and discuss the goals of brain-based assessment. Brain-based education refers to teaching methods, lesson designs, and school programs that are based on the latest scientific research about how the brain learns, including such factors as cognitive development, how students learn differently as they age grow, and mature socially, emotionally, and cognitively. All of us faced some difficulties in learning for ourselves or for our students. In this course, you should know what are the learning styles. There are different learning styles, visual, auditory, reading or writing, and kinesthetic. Everyone should know his learning style in order to facilitate the learning process. All instructors should know how to stimulate different learners as we all have different types of learners in our sessions. In order to stimulate different learners, we have to use animation, 3D images, pictures, individual characters, music, videos, and all of those should need professional training. Now, we are going to know the theories of brain-based education and how to use them in application. We have many different types of theories. Those are some uh, theories listed in this slide. Each theory has its application. In general, we can use different dialects, interviews, role plays, presentations, rapid writing, communications, in order to use the language in brain-based education. In addition, we can use the games which encourage student engagement in the learning process. And there are many different applications of brain-based education that can be used during learning. What about brain-based assessment? Brain-based assessment aims to generate new forms of assessment designed to support deep and lasting learning. We do not aim at short-term learning. We aim at long-term lasting learning. What's the goal? What are the goals for brain-based assessment? First, feedback. Feedback deepens students' memory and produces better for performance of learning. Active retrieval. It produces significant long-term benefits for learning compared with passive studying, and it helps students to embed the material into their long-term memory. In addition, it helps the student to reach his peak potential and discover himself in order to improve the achievement. This helps the students to spend shorter duration of time in studying. Benefits of brain-based assessment. In brain-based assessment, the learning becomes more personalized. Each student will learn and be tested according to his brain and not a, a single type of assessment used to all students. In addition, it encourages students to adopt a mindset focused on discovery. Finally, as this is our aim in learning, it helps students to be more engaged in the learning process. We hope you enjoyed our video and you got benefit of it. MLWeb Group 8. Thank you.